mean, I think it's important just to note how powerful it was to have, you know, the, the moments when the president would step away and allow ordinary Americans to speak personally about how this new tax deal would help them. Right. And, and you know, this is something that uh, presidents have always done. And I think it's a, a good idea because what it does is it says to the American public, here are real people with real mm -hmm. families, and here's how much they're going to save on a tax bill. It's a very good way to sell it. Um, you're not bringing corporate titans up there to say their corporate taxes are going to be reduced substantially. Uh, what you are doing is you're bringing families up there who are telling you what they're going to do with the extra money. And of course, it's very touching when one of those families says, look, you know, we're going to take this money and we're going to give it away to help other people, particularly at, at this season. So, you know, this is, you know, this is not a new technique, but it's an effective one. Stephen Moore, how do you do? Hi, uh, I thought it, I agree with uh, Gloria. I thought that was a powerful moment, bringing up those uh, families. You know, it's been uh, two years I've been working with Donald Trump on this, and you know, we are so close to the finish line. Um, it is true that a lot of families are going to save money on their taxes, but look, the the bigger picture here is this is about growing the economy, making America more prosperous. Uh, as Trump was. I was looking at the bottom of the CNN screen and looking at what's happening at the stock market. It's an amazing story. I and mean, the, the market just keeps going up and up. It really wants this tax cut. Uh, Gloria's right. Businesses want this. They're employers. And I think, I think it'll be a powerful stimulus to the bill. One other quick thing, uh, Brooke, is that he mentioned the growth rate of the economy. You know, we are growing at now three to three and a half percent. And, and uh, I do think if we get this tax cut passed, we could potentially get four percent growth next year, which we haven't had that in a long, long time.